How's it going? I'm Taryn Rice. Uh, today we're gonna we're gonna break a colt. Has not been messed with much. He's uh, he's barely halter broke, um, just enough to to get him caught and maybe lead him around a little bit. Uh, we had to catch him last week. And we got him castrated, and uh, that's about as much as he's been as much as he's been messed with. He hadn't had hands on him much. Sure, hadn't been blanketed. Um, a lot of the colts that we get to break come through the sales and they've been uh, messed with since they were weanlings and they've been sail fitted and and uh, lunged in the round pen and worked in the round pen, uh, blanketed. So we're going to, they're a lot easier. We're going to mess with one today that, that never has been so that you can see uh, what to do when situations arise that, um, that you don't get when dealing with maybe a, a gentler horse. So hopefully he's not too wild or nothing, but we can maybe see a few things that that you normally don't see on the gentler horses we deal with today. He's still just a little cautious of me walking up here. We'd like to get him where he's just really relaxed that I can just walk right up to him, pet him. If he turns away, goes to take off. I'm going to show him that that's not good, and that's work. We're going to run around here a little bit more. May rope him, let him get used to that. Use that to keep him going. Sometimes I like to toss that lead over their butt. Just let them get used to that, being on their back, touching him as he goes around there, down around his legs. When you saddle them up for the first time, once again, I don't want to protect them, but at the same time, I don't want the cinches to fall over and whack them in the side hard enough that they're going to jump on top of me. Okay, he's licking his lips. That's the first time the saddle's ever been thrown on him, and he's already licking his lips. 